सो हाई एवरीबडी आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड एंड येस आई एम बैक विथ अनदर वीडियो एंड दिस टाइम वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट वॉट इंजीनियर्स फेस राइट आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन एंड यू ऑल नो आई हैव कम्पलीटेड माई कंप्यूटर साइंस इंजीनियरिंग एंड राइट आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन आई केम टू बैंगलोर एंड टुक दिस कोर्स नाउ फॉर मी एंड आई गेस फॉर एवरी इंजीनियर्स आउट देर दीज आर द ऑप्शन दैट दे हैव गॉन थ्रू लाइक दीज आर द स्टेज दैट दे हैव गॉन थ्रू फर्स्ट तो इज़ एम बी ए और एनी मास्टर और एनी हायर एजुकेशन एंड मोस्टली एम बी ए बिकॉज इवन आई वॉन्ट टू डू एम बी ए राइट आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन बट आई वॉज क्लियर दैट आई वॉन्ट टू गेट इन टू मैनेजमेंट साइड एंड नॉट इन टू द टेक्निकल साइड तो दैट इज द वन ऑप्शन एंड सेकेंड ऑप्शन इज गवर्नमेंट जॉब्स लाइक इवन माई फ्रेंड्स आर गोइंग थ्रू दिस यू पी एस सी कोचिंग एंड अदर गवर्नमेंट जॉब्स लाइक बैंकिंग आई टू एंड ऑल and that is the second option and third option is a course of course few people will go for business that is secondary but these are the major three options or stages that people in engineer go through right after graduation and for me i wanted to do mba but i couldn't do it and i wanted to do mtech also but because i wanted to get into professor that is easy option right and yes i didn't choose that also and later i decided of course government job is not for me and later i decided i will take a course in bangalore so if you are someone who is clear that you want to get into higher education or government job then that's good for you but if you are someone who wants to take up a course in bangalore or in any other places pehle to you understand whether you want to get into technical side or non technical side because in technical side there are many options available that are actually booming in the market like cloud computing aws data science cyber security data analyst etc so if you want to get into non technical side pehle to you sit and understand where your interest lies in and see what all options are there in non technical side and once you get to know that this is the particular course that i am want to take understand why you should be doing that course because it will only motivate you to take that course of course and but also understand why you shouldn't be taking that course because once you understand that it will uh, make you realize that yes these are the particular risk that i will be taking in the future like for example when i understood about the digital marketing i also studied studied about why i shouldn't be doing the course and i got to know about the cons of the course and i got to know that this these are the risks that i will be taking in the future and i was willing to take those risks and if you are someone who is willing to take those risks then that's good for you take that course and yes but one thing i want to highlight is regardless of what course you are taking technical non technical or anything placement guarantee is just a lie i want to highlight that because see of course these courses will tell that yes job guarantee is there but see think about it it's not their duty to actually sit you down and you know get you placed in the company no of course it is you at the end because you are supposed to take all those rounds clear all those rounds face interview so it is you at the end who is supposed to clear the interview and get into job it is not their job so placement guarantee is a lie so make sure your communication skills are good and just don't blame them because it is a lie i am saying don't expect that they will place you in a company because of course they, their job is just to teach you and bring placement drives to you your job at the end it is you who is supposed to clear all those rounds face the interview and get into better job so don't keep that in mind ke once i sign up for this course i will be placed no and yeah so and also one thing avoid getting into such agency or institute that will take huge number of people in one single batch because you will not get that personal attention if you have any doubts so i don't suggest you to go because even if you ask many people and this is one thing that i want to highlight don't ask many people like your senior side to nim colleague side to like colleague side to really anyway nim senior side to nim friend side to jaasti jana kelak hoga ka hobedre because ena keti now baal mundhe kelko thoktivi en madbek en madbek and once you will 
get confused you will be like confused like hell because there is many people five people are there five people will give you 10 different ideas and you will just confuse yourself even more so just understand that yes i want to do this and i want to get into this because of course it will just confuse you even more and yes don't get into uh, the huge intake wala thing that i said earlier bahar mandi netko tar nam yel personal attention sikti where whenever you have a doubt because na yel adinla literally one 15 members that that is the highest strength bahar mandi tundru nu bahar gun janasthiti and nemaga do sari ne ansangilla i don't know how it is comfortable but i i got comfortable with my course i'm lucky that i am into such course so and the agency is also good ಭಾಳ ಕಮ್ಮಿ ಜನ ಅದಾರ್ ಇನ್ ಒನ್ ಬ್ಯಾಚ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ಚಲೋ ಟೀಚ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದೋಸ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಸೊ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಅ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಆ್ಯಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದಟ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ದಟ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಯೂಸ್ಫುಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಮೈ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಲಿಟ್ರಲಿ ಗೆಟಿಂಗ್ ಬೆಟರ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದಟ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಅಟೆನ್ಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಭಾಳ ಮಂದಿ ಇದ್ದರು ಈವನ್ ದಟ್ ಟೀಚರ್ ಆರ್ ಟ್ರೈನಿ ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಯು ವಿತ್ ದ ಡೌಟ್ಸ್ so i suggest you these things to pehle to don't call many people don't confuse yourself even more and make sure the batch size and yes and if you are willing to take the risk get into the course because bhar mandi en martar engineer nagala they'll just fly to bangalore and see yavdare famous id institute ko gurtare il madidra akiti antu it's not true because adu our the duty alla even we cannot blame the college we cannot blame the training institute because it is at the end it is we or it is you who is supposed to clear all the rounds sit and clear all the rounds and face the interview and i hope idu ee video it has helped a little bit and cleared little uh, doubts of yours i am just sharing my experience i am not saying that i am pro i am just sharing my experience and i hope that it cleared a little bit of your doubts and also comment down that uh, if you are someone whoever is watching this video comment down uh, which field you are in whether you are working you are not working or whatever it is just comment down and let me know uh, which field you are in or what your profession is and you all know what i am going to say now that is bye everybody and take care and also share it to many people and like share subscribe that is to it is there and yes boy